Hey babies, it's Joy Vaughn and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new, then welcome. So today I am back with another protective style video for you guys. Happy 2020, happy new year. Um, I brought in the new year with some spring twists and as you guys know, my birthday just passed. So for my birthday, this was the hairstyle that I wanted to try out. I usually try out a new hairstyle for my birthday every year and this was one that was on my list and I absolutely love it. I did it myself and I did it really really quickly. <laughs> it only took me like a couple of hours to do and I did not plan on filming it so that's why I didn't film it originally but a lot of you guys asked me how I did it myself so I wanted to come on here and give you guys a video so without further ado let's just go ahead and jump into the tutorial all right you guys so I just took out two of my twists so obviously I can show you guys how to install these bad boys so I use the Outre expression twisted up hair and this is the color 2T1B slash 350 so I got four packs of these and I didn't even wind up using all four packs I used about like three and like a quarter so three and a half basically packs of this hair and this is what it looks like when you take it out it's super bouncy it stretches really really long and it's really soft I really really like it I love this color though because it is the exact color of my hair since I dyed it like you guys is this not spot on this is so spot on it's crazy I picked this hair up from a beauty supply store in Harlem just while I was in New York City in Harlem Christmas shopping um, so I'm not sure if this particular hair or brand would be local to you but you can check if I can't find the exact hair to this um, I will link something extremely similar in the description box down below for you guys to check out so obviously since I did my hair already and I'm just kind of going back and showing you guys my hair is already sectioned off to prep my hair for this style I just did my typical wash routine I did recently post actually it was like the last video I posted before this video my wash routine on how I currently you know wash and prep my hair for the week so check that video out after this one but so after you've created your section what you want to do is grab a rubber band and just attach your rubber band From here I like to take a crochet needle you don't have to take a crochet needle I just find that it's just a lot easier especially if you're a beginner at doing your hair yourself and yeah it's just it's just really convenient for me so I take my crochet needle and then I put it through and then I fold the hair in half and I'm going to attach it to the needle Close the latch and pull it through. Let it out and pull one side through, right? All right, so stick with me here, follow me. So from here, you're just going to start braiding and I'm gonna show you guys this in a second. But as I'm braiding, I'm going to start twisting. Now, what's important about the twisting process that I learned is that you have to twist in a certain direction for this to come out right now I watched a couple tutorials on this and I don't know a couple people were having issues with it at first and then they got the hang of it but I'm right-handed right so I'm naturally going to twist in this direction this is just the natural direction that I'm going to twist my hair if you are left-handed if you're left-handed you have to twist in the opposite direction of how you would naturally twist your hair I hope that helps you um, I watched a video where someone said that just everyone is supposed to twist in the opposite direction and that is not true I'm right-handed so I have to twist in my you know natural way of twisting 
but if you are left-handed you have to twist in the opposite direction so like I said you're just going to start braiding your hair down first maybe just like three or four times nothing crazy just enough so that it feels pretty secure and then attaching my hair with the false hair I'm just going to start two strand twisting as I would normally and there you go there is your twist So now that my hair is done, the only other thing that I like to do is lay my edges. So I'm going to use my Care Care Healthy Edges Edge Control just to lay them down pretty simply, easily, nothing crazy. Now I'm going to take some leave-in conditioner. This is my Eden Body Works Therapy Leave-In Conditioner Spray and I'm just going to spray my scalp with it. What I like about this spray is that it smells really good, it feels good on my scalp, and it doesn't leave my hair feeling like sticky. You know that like sticky feeling that you get with some sprays? I definitely don't get that with this one. All right, you guys, so that is pretty much it for today's tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this was helpful for you. I absolutely love these twists. I've done a lot of twist styles before. I've never done spring twists and I really, really love them. I love how natural they look. I love how kinky they are. Like, it's just so cute, it's so easy, it's so lightweight. I literally feel nothing on my head. It's like, it's literally so weightless. It's gorgeous. You could do some really, really fun stuff with this too, like add lock jewelry, like all that cute stuff, some little like, gold jewels you know how the girls like to do but I like to keep it simple and I really just love it um I've had it now like I said for about a week and I'll probably keep it for another week and a half another two weeks probably and just kind of chill let my hair rest relax so if you guys want to see any other videos of me with this hair styling this hair answering some questions about it or anything please let me know before i take it out because i will gladly film that for you also too if you like this video feel free to give it a big thumbs up leave a comment down below on any questions or anything that you might have subscribe to my channel if you haven't already is absolutely free and until then i will just see you guys in my next video bye